Hi friends, welcome to Tutors Funny channel. Today I am going to teach how to make the employee salary calculation system using Java FX. So let's make the Java new FX project. So how to make the Java FX project? First we have to go to the file, new project. Select next. Next. You have to type this as employee salary calculation. Salary, we just type salary. Click finish. Uh, you have to wait new window. Right now, your project has been created successfully. You can see here. Yeah, you can see this. Are, there is a folder which is a SRC folder. Select the SRC folder, right click. First, I am going to make the two packages one is a controller. Second package is a view. We have a we need three package, two packages. Controller package. Select the controller package, right click new. You have to create a Java class, which is a employee form. You have to type like this. It's an efficient way. Whatever type you have to type employee form. This is a controller. View, select the view, right click new. Here you have to make this file as fxml. Here employee form. Employee form view. This one employee form, you have to make the simple, uh, you have to click on this one you have to here refactor rename you would make this one as a controller this one employee form controller right this is a control this is a view right right here employee view here this is a view so here we have to this call the control so how to call the controller you call a control is reside on controller package dot employee form controller right here to call that okay this control will be working right after that what you're going to do is i'm going to create another file which is a app initializer so select here you have to write java fx application app initializer initializer you just type like this right this file inside the stage i have to write this one to load the stage to load the stage okay so here is a parent you have to add on the or add alt press enter this one should be alt press you have to enter the packages import the packages so here we have to scenes also we have to add it this one should be the not error click on the load click here add exception to method right so first you have to type parent fxml load this class resources we have to give the resources which page you have to load up which page will be employee employee form view from from i just give the name wrong so it's no problem this page you have to load so load the page your pages reside on view spoiler this is the page since here we have a welcome form this is how we have loaded stitch right this is how we have loaded stitch okay, if you have run it right this one we have to load the stitch right this is a simple stuff right now what you are going to do is after that after that the stuff you have to go to the fx uh, i run it so i just stop it here the, the page is running now here yeah, this page is has no window just a welcome form only now i want to go to the view i'm going to make the view right so if you are not installed the scenes builder, you must install the scenes builder in your machine. How to install the scenes builder? I have already done in our previous videos. You go through my playlist of uh, Intel J with uh, Java FX, you must learn, right? It's simple. After that, here yeah, there will be the open in scenes builder. You nothing to nothing to code anything else. If you, you you can open it on the scenes builder. It will be open up the, your scenes builder is open. If you are click open, your scenes builder is open. Right, this is in builder. Now we have here where we can design the form. 
first we have to get the label label if you need you can put in the label otherwise you can put all the things of text field text field now new method is this drag it over here your new method is this this one should be you can write a placeholder over here you can write a placeholder over here yeah? from it text you have to write employees name another text field salary after that this one should be tax this one should be net sell we need one button this it okay right now here now we now the new pattern is we have right like this okay you can put you if you need you can put it the label and write it it's very simple we have right like this okay here we have to put the heading so uh, label you get the one label this label i'm going to just employee salary employee salary all right so you have to increase the font size a little bit bigger right now what i'm going to do is this is a simple page you have created right so if we have if we need text color we need to be changed like this now let i'm going to do this here this is okay button this this all text we click on this one go to the code section id we have right first one said txt name employee name this one should be txt salary if you type plus enter key then only it will be okay this one should be txt tax press enter key this one should be txt in cell press enter key right that's it now what you're going to do, click on the button the button also we have to go to the on click action you have to write here btn click press enter key right now let's save file save file save and file quit right perfect okay perfect now this all the id is very simple here okay you please you watch carefully this all the id is your important to go click on here create a field text name it will be imported to the control this all the ids okay this is how we have created okay click on here click here it is important this how you have the effects work click on here create it this one also insert click here create the field out of that that's it the button also you have to implement click on here it's a bulk symbol create the method right method has been created right now simple first you have to calculate the employee salary so you have to create a variable double salary cell equal this text field name dot get text get text you have to write get text get text this is not a you have to write double you have to convert them as a double pass you have to write here like this right after that we have to write that now what the salary you entered on the text field it will assign to the variable cell now here we have to make the calculation if the salary is the salary if you type the salary <coughs> more than 50,000 include 10 percentage tax of so tax you have to create the variable tax double tax comma and cell get the different variables right tax equal cell cell 10 per include 10 percent tax else if
5 30000 if it is uh, if the salary is more than 30000 uh, 5 percent else we have no tax so we have tax equal zero the simple query we have tried out of that what you are going to do is out of that we have to pass into the this tax into the uh, txt uh, what is the variable you have to pass it tax this is a text field dot set text pass in the text here also you have to write string dot value of your pass in this text over here that's it how does that net, net salary calculation you have to you have to create a, already create a variable in cell you have to get them and cell we have to minus it tax get the answer you have to print it down as over here txt in cell you have to pass the initial key that's it that's how you have to calculate the net cell okay very simple now let's run and check whether it's working fine or not it's working now employee salary employee name raja salary 12000 click here here 12000 is below below 30000 so here no tax if it is a 52000 it include 10 percent tax it will be display if it is 32000 include 5 percent tax will be calculated right very simple this program we did if you have any doubt on this you can ask me anytime if you love my channel please subscribe me like me thank you for watching